land where nature is generously flaunting its beauty, mesmerizing the hearts of those who encounter it. A land nestled beneath the blankets of clouds, quietly surrounded by the lush green hills. Stored behind these majestic landscapes and sceneries are the rich cultural heritage. Dwelling among these magical hills and the joyful valleys are the people whose charming ways will warm your hearts. A land once ruled by a mighty king, Nongda Lairin Pakhangba, whose beautiful abode, Gangla Fort, a place for sacred rituals and practices, is an overwhelming and captivating sight that lies in the heart of the Imphal city. A land known for its mystical Loktak Lake, the largest freshwater lake in Northeast India and a World Heritage Site, is a unique lake with floating swamps where the only floating national park in the world exists and is a home to the magnificent pro antler deer, Sangai, whose only home is this national park. A land wherein lies one of the most important pilgrimage destinations, Sri Sri Govindaji Temple for the spiritual seekers, is a temple devoted to Lord Krishna and his consort Radha. A land whose rich culture is reflected in every corner of its landscape and architecture. A land where several significant battles were fought. And to this day, the history is honored and commemorated in several memorial places that will tell you the stories of great sacrifices and service. In this beautiful land lies the Ima Kaithil. Ima meaning the mother and Kaithil meaning the market is a place symbolizing feminine power. This all-woman market is considered as the only one in the world and is run by over 3,000 women coming from different parts of the state. A land where the sport of kings, Polo, has its origin written in the mythological history and is believed that Lord Ibudho Marji, the master horseman, along with other gods from the heaven, would come down on earth and have a battle of Polo at Kangjibu which is the oldest polo ground in the world. A land of various ancient sports and martial arts is keeping the traditions of the ancestors alive. A land whose performance arts is a talk among cultural practitioners and art lovers all over the world with mesmerizing dance forms and ballets like the Ras Leela, Nat Sankirtan, and Pung Cholom, and folk dances like the Maibi Jagui, Kabui dance, Thado Kuki dance, Pankul Naga dance, among many others. A land as such is a paradise for adventure seekers who can trek those high and rigorous trails in search of those deep hidden waterfalls in Okro and Tamenglong districts or trek long uphill paths while enjoying breathtaking views to camp and spend a night of stargazing at the peaks of Shiri Hills and Sugo Valley. A land where development is a constant process that is taking place every day, when new opportunities are opening up in different sectors. A land which is a gateway to other Southeast Asian countries is now starting a direct flight service with Air KBC from Imphal to Mandalay starting this 23rd November 2019 onwards twice every week. A land where people are merry and celebrate life with so much of festivity, bringing together all its communities, spreading the spirit of love and harmony. And finally, it is a land where its people will welcome you to come, live with them and experience the feeling, the feeling that is Manipur. <laughs>